First, the trauma of a rape, then the trauma of a legal battle to abort the pregnancy. There finally seems to be a respite for a 14-year-old rape survivor. In a special evening session, the Supreme Court comprising CGI, D.Y. Chandrachur and Justice J.B. Pardiwala has ordered an immediate medical examination of a 14-year-old rape survivor seeking to terminate a 28-week pregnancy. Now, the court demanded a prompt report submission before the next hearing, which is scheduled for April 22. In fact, my colleague Harish joins us on the broadcast to get us more details on this. Harish, this is, an, of course, an absolute shocker coming to the fore of 14-year-old that was raped. Earlier, the Bombay High Court denied her any sort of a relief. And now, finally, the Supreme Court has ordered some sort of a medical uh, test that has to be carried out. Give us more details about this case. Yes, in a special uh, uh, evening sitting yesterday, post the uh, normal courthouse, the chief justice bench ordered immediate medical examination of a 14-year-old rape survivor who sought a direction to terminate a 28-week pregnancy. Uh, a bench of uh, the chief justice of India, D.B. Chandrachud and J.B. Justice J.B. Padiwala directed for an examination, including the possible impact of pregnancy on her mental and physical health. Now the bench decided to consider the matter on Monday as the first item, 10.30 a.m. itself. Court was informed that the Bombay High Court had on April 4 rejected the, her plea. Uh, in fact, the plea filed by the mother of the minor. After the dismissal of the plea, she moved the Supreme Court seeking termination of her daughter's pregnancy. It is alleged that the minor girl was subjected to sexual assault following which she got pregnant. And an FIR was also lodged in this regard. Uh, in fact, additional Solicitor General Aishwarya Bhatti submitted that uh, it is necessary for the court to be apprised of the impact of carrying out the pregnancy of the minor on her physical and uh, mental health. Um, in fact, the court said the victim girl should be examined by hospital at Sion Hospital on April 20. We request the Council of the State of Alastra to arrange for to and fro a transportation of the petitioner and daughter to the hospital. The report of the hospital shall be placed before this court on 10, at 10.30 a.m. on Monday. So she will be examined at Bombay Sion Hospital on April, that is today. Uh, and the report has to be placed before the Supreme Court uh, by Monday and 10.30 a.m. Monday. Supreme Court will once again take up this matter. All right. All right, Arish, appreciate you joining us on the broadcast there with all those details.